Threads is doing the rounds again. And for those of you who are younger and haven't seen it, it was a post-nuclear apocalypse drama that was on BBC television in September of 1984. I was very heavily pregnant at the time and it gave me... I probably would have got mild postnatal depression anyway. I was in a very abusive marriage, but it funneled that into a tendency to store rice and food and tins and beans which I have always struggled with. If I'm worried about something, you'll find I'm stacking baked beans in corners. I've only just about got over that the last few years. It was one of those things, I think, even now, people need to see it because I think it was as realistic a depiction as anybody could give without it actually being realistic. It was terrifying. It was just horrendous. And... At that point, the threat of nuclear war was really hanging over us. If you look at the music, uh, there was so much music uh, referencing the nuclear threat as well. I mean, we were all bloody terrified. And I still kind of am. You know, I do remember asking my mother, who at the time lived probably about a mile and a half away from Charles Veneth Nuclear Power Station, which would have been a target and saying, what would you do? And she said, push you all outside the front door, put you in the car and drive as close to the power station as we could get. She said, because there'd be no reason for us to do anything than be vaporised. She would said, so everybody I loved in the car and the closer we could get, the quicker we'd be vaporised. And that scared me. That really scared me. <laughs> 